child marriage it's ruining the lives of millions of girls around the globe when people usually hear this they think about less developed nations including Africa Asia and Central America what if I tell you that that's not the case for Angel who lives in Idaho the United States of America I got married I had just turned 13 we stood in my living room and in this ugly dress that my mother bought off the internet and shortly after getting married she encouraged us to start having kids and that's why I had my first son when I was 15 it was a way for me to I think be dependent on her many states do not even require minimum age of marriage she's not alone and here is what others have to say this is that 11 year old girl that got married this is the dress that my mom made when you look back at that photo what do you, what do you think it shouldn't have happened. I think that this shouldn't be. Child marriage steals girls from their childhood and drenches their lives and health. Girls who marry before 18 are more likely to experience domestic violence and less likely to remain in school. My ex, he was extremely abusive to me and um, and I was very confused because this is the only guy I had ever been with. So when he started, you know, shoving me and all that stuff while I was pregnant, like I thought, like this is my life, what's, like how could this be? They have worse economic and health outcomes than their unmarried peers, which are eventually passed down to their own children, father straining a country capacity to provide quality health and education services. So this practice can also isolate girls from family and friends and exclude them from participating in their communities and taking heavy toll on their physical and psychological well-being. You know, idea that my mother wanted us to just all be together and for me to have kids so young and to do all of that, I still have all of this emotional baggage of wanting to have done something with my life by now. It is really all the time that I think about what I could have done or could have been. Is there any hope for these little girls? Yes, we can end child marriage, but we have to educate and empower young girls. Education plays a critical role in keeping girls safe from child marriage. In fact, the longer a girl stays in a school, the less likely she is to be married before age 18. Every girl has the right to decide her own future, but not every girl knows this. That's why empowering girls is crucial to ending child marriage. When girls are confident in their abilities and armed with knowledge of their rights and supported by peers, groups of the empowered girls they are able to stand up and say no to injustice just like child marriage providing families with livelihood opportunities like microfinance loans is effective way to prevent child marriage that occur as the result of financial need in the countries where child marriage it's common petitioning government to increase the minimum age for marriage to 18 years old is critical first step for positive change. What are you doing today to help your sister and others not to become a victim of child marriage? Child marriage is a crisis that's affecting millions of kids around the globe. We can all work together and eliminate child marriage and create a safe environment for our future kids. And remember, it starts with you. Thank you.